Hi guys, so today I'm going to do the alteration of this dress. Yes, uh, the sheen fever is going on and this is from the sheen. So everything is fine, it's just the length is, uh, I have to fix the length about 3 inches. So this is how it is. So there are two different ways you can uh, do the alterations to fix the length and I'm going to show you right now. It's a very quick fix again uh, so let's just begin it has border so and if you want to keep the border so what you can do is where your border ends just mark from there half an inch and then cut straight and then you have to measure that how long you want your dress to be shortened for example in this case i want like three inches short okay then i'm going to cut three inches from here and then join both pieces together but if you want to avoid the joint piece mark then you can use these kind of laces these called joint laces okay so what happens is i'm not going to use that so i'm just going to show you for example these are your two pieces and you want to join them so i have like different patterns here this one has flowers and this one has like a small flower and some kind of shape and this one is like this they're available in colors as well so you, they're easily available they are made out of cotton and they're not that expensive too what you can do is put this one side on top of this and you have to stitch here it's easy to see you on it okay so if you're not comfortable with sewing uh with the machine right away then you can either pin them together or you can hand sew it and then make a top stitch with your sewing machine and it's gonna look like this it's gonna create some kind of design and they would look perfect hopefully you can see it clearly that's way it looks beautiful and nice but if you don't want to do anything you don't want to cut hair which in my case i'm going to do that then there is a joint here but it's little tricky for the beginners because it has elastic inserted let me show you so you can see it has elastic in it like this so what i'm going to do i'm going to take off the elastic and i'm going to pick all the threads from all around and then i am going to cut it like three inches okay so i separated the top and the bottom and here is the elastic so for now i don't need elastic in top part of the dress so i'm gonna put them aside now this is the skirt part so what i am going to do is first iron on it i'm going to use this chalk because i don't want to use um, marker or some other color because chalk's gonna you can just swipe it away and it will go okay and it's a white color so i don't want to use anything else now what i will do is i'm going to make sure that everything is even out from top okay and from top i'm going to mark on three inches like so and then i will just cut them away you have to make sure you are going to mar mark all around because this is cut little slightly in a shape so this is going to be my middle point and i'm just going to cut on this that's it now you can see that this is a little out from the sides what you can do is just make a straight stretch on the side to make sure both the fabric have the same weight so i'm going to iron on it and then i'm going to sew the, both pieces together and then i will sew this elastic
all right so i joined both the pieces together now it's time to sew the elastic so let me show you how i am going to do this okay so this is the inside seam or i just flip it on the downwards on the skirt side and this is my elastic i'm going to sew the elastic on top to seal these raw edges as well or if what you can do you can overlock this to have a clean edges or you can just turn it inside and then you can have a clean edge like this okay so now what i am going to do is i'm just gonna i'm just going to fold this inside so i don't want any raw edges so it's totally optional if you want to do it or not this is for someone so i just want to do the clean stitching right if you are charging for something then you have to be so you like professionals if you are doing it for yourself then you can skip steps okay so I need something to push my fabric a little bit okay so the key here is you have to stretch the elastic okay first few stitches are hard I am done here and here you can see this is how it is I'm just gonna iron on it and it would look just fine I wish I can get you the before and after pictures but these are usually for my customers so it's hard for me but I try uh, my best to give you a little bit tips and tricks in you know the quick fix video so this is how I did my uh, length alterations so that's about it for this video and I will be I will try my best to give you the before and after pictures but it's a little bit difficult for me since these are my customers uh, dresses and right now I have like a lot of customer work going on so these that's the reason I am not able to give you the full tutorial kind of videos because I have to just uh, see it and just give them in you know just finish it on time and just give them out so that's it and I hope I can I these videos are going to be useful for the beginners as well and for those who are looking for everyday kind of quick fix things so that's it and until the next time peace bye